What is up, everyone? Welcome back to Nefarix Plays. Yakuza Like a Dragon Gate. And before we get started, make sure to like, comment, subscribe down below. It does help out the channel. And let's go ahead and dive right in. Where we left off last time was starting our second sub-story about the Namioka family. And we're just trying to see what happens. Um, what tripped us off last time was there was a blue-haired granny who just started, like, bugging us and just getting in our way. And it was just so out of pocket. So we're just making our way down to the bis... Dude, look at the photos in the back. <laughs> oh, my God. What? Summer? What is that? What is that franchise? Sega? That's that's a Japanese game in the background. Like, all right. All right. Club Sega. Oh, blue hair granny coming out again. What the hell? Junturo-chan. Damn it. Now of all times, Junturo-chan. Where's that voice coming from? I can't see who it is. Jintaro-chan. No time to think. I have to act fast. Not sure what you're talking about. Act like you're also looking for him. <laughs> Need to get out of here. I'm gonna also act. Calm down. No one knows it's me they're calling for. Maybe if I pretend to be searching too. Jintaro-chan. <laughs> You just yo <laughs> Juntaro chan. Juntaro chan. Juntaro san. I just heard you yell Juntaro san. It's Juntaro chan. <laughs> Juntaro san. <laughs> Juntaro chan. You just yell Juntaro san again. It's Juntaro chan. You're trying to avoid everyone's attention by shouting Juntaro san. Juntaro chan. Damn it, this isn't working. I'm just trying attention to myself like an idiot. What? <laughs> I just wanted to see what would happen. <laughs> like, that's that's literally what I would do in this situation. <laughs> He's just like, I look stupid as fuck. I'm like, the hell is that voice coming from? Wait. I love that she has a leopard on her t-shirt. <laughs> no, 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 no. Junturo-chan. I could sense you were nearby. <laughs> it's a real gas watching you squirm. I'm gonna choose every single dub option that this game provides. This is so funny. Tee could I sense you were right near? It was a real gas Good. watching, please. Never just yell for me like that if I can't see you. Ah, uh, you're no phone. How come? What do you mean, how come? I would have assumed you know how uncomfortable it is to summon you on the street. <laughs> I don't know what's worse, dude. The guy's like, ugh, or her. <laughs> Oh, are you gonna sh I, yeah. I like I'm sensitive. You're missing the point here. Relax, lover boy. I actually need you to fence up so I could. What could you possibly need me for? Why don't you come with me to buy some bread tomorrow? I could use the company. I'll even show you my favorite bakery. <laughs> the fact that you ran it to her twice. Mm -hmm. Bread for tomorrow. Yep, they'll be taken out of the oven right about now, fresh and fluffy. It's fresh, but you're buying it for tomorrow. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. What's wrong with you, honey? Got a tummy ache. If you want fresh baked bread, why would you freeze it or put it in the fridge? I think that's why he's like sitting down. He's like, what the? F <laughs> Maybe a little dizzy, that's all. <laughs> Gracious, well that won't do at all. Here, take this candy and go Ugh. get some rest. Thanks. Just a little something to help get your blood sugar up. <sighs> you okay if I head home then? Sure, honey. Sure, don't want you pushing yourself if you're not feeling well. After all, the bakery ain't going anyway. Mm. Be okay by yourself? Should I walk you back? Yeah. No, no, it's fine. If you run into trouble, just ask people around for help. You won't find a shortage of human kindness in Osaka, you know? 
That's so funny. The fact that he's like in this blue afro grandma is just flirting with him. You lost him again. Sorry. It's like some fidgety Drapple gamer came in and replaced my favorite guy. What happened this time? Is that lady again? Come on, Joryu. That's a real lame excuse coming from you. <laughs> it's not some frivolous romance thing you gotta believe. Me. She kept calling me over and over on the street. She wanted me to go buy bread. Alright. If you're not feeling up to this one, I got someone else I can call to take care of it. No, no more slip sods. That's a promise. <sighs> Club of E Shokofu. Ugh. Leave it to me. This is a fun sub story. I really enjoy this one. It's a lot. The game could go um, left field as far. Okay, it looks like right there. It can go like into a horror, creepy murder type of thing, like the first story. But like, I appreciate that the second follow-up sub story to put flavor in it was a blue-haired grandma just flirting with you. That is fun, but that is a lot. I did get a couple keys. Contact lenses, damn. Carter and Max, and then it was J1. Bless for armor replica. Wait. That's my gear. It's purely defense. Blade defense. Blade resistance on. I would love to be able to equip multiple items. I hate to say, but as far as like actual numbers on the board, that's what works. I almost spot shit right there. I forgot what I was doing this for. Um, we're going for the dragon eyes of Dojima. Instead of like pursuing the game. Okay. I think this is the place Akame was talking about. No more distractions. It's now Miyoka. Let's see where he's going. That would be interesting to me to be that important where like somebody needed to do recon on me. I guess I should follow, like I hold something that valuable to them. And if somebody's like, I'll pay you a thousand dollars to do X, I'm like, okay. What? I'm a customer. To find you drinking buddies to be glued so tight to our asses, Paul. Saw you back in the shopping district too, making one hell of a racket, weren't you? Guess they noticed me. No surprises there. Hey man, ain't you ain't Omi, are you? Yeah. As, the, as in the Omi Alliance. Now oh, you're playing detective then? Playing detective? Did we pass each other earlier today or something? If you're able to remember the face of a random passerby in such a busy city, maybe you're the one who should be a detective. how more dudes just come out you're awfully calm what's your resting heart rate 50 just who are you I mean you're not gonna be working with somebody right yeah nope just a law-abiding citizen trying to enjoy his afternoon All right cuz law-abiding citizens usually call themselves uh. that they sure do I hear it's becoming sort of a meme <laughs> I was screenshotting that <laughs> Oh, dude, this is why I love this game. They have like such... Ah, it's so funny. This is definitely more attention than I want to attract. But it seems like they're still treading lightly. Maybe they don't want to start something unless they're sure. That's the case. Should be easy enough to keep playing dumb. So what do we do about this guy? The boss said to keep a low profile, so I don't know. Yeah, but this guy is a Yakuza. He's yeah. gonna talk. I already told you I'm not Yakuza. Shut it, will ya? We know low life when we spawn. <sighs> 
and it doesn't matter who you're telling who I am because I'm not even a regular criminal though. Just saying. Can't say recognize him. Most are recognizing the first place dummy. That said, I don't think he's an ordinary citizen either, so who the hell are you? <laughs> Here too. <laughs> Running to each other even a place like this. Why we must be bound by a red string of destiny. The hell you want, Granny? Nah. What do you mean the hell you want? You might understand if you weren't spending all your time with the boys. Gotta snag yourself a lover like my Junthro chan. What? Lady, you're in disguise. <laughs> you got a problem with cabbage. You know, you could have just said if you were here to meet someone. Guess he must have been embarrassed. <laughs> I mean, look how much older she is. You shut your goddamn mouth. These two are consenting adults. Quit being so ages. Oh, cute. See, this guy gets it. <laughs> you ought to show some pride, man. Sure, your privacy is one thing, but times have changed. Don't be ashamed of your love. I wish I had that. I, uh, I know exactly. I want to clip that and I want to attach it to a ringtone, like a text tone, and I know exactly who I would put that on. Oh, just. Y'all got him, that one annoying friend. You just gotta clip it to them. This is so funny. Wise words, don't you think, Juntoro? Honestly, we ought to thank you for getting our heads straight. This worked out for the best. <laughs> so, um, just how long are you planning on this stick around? Nah! Fighting in a place like this would have been a real Daddy. joke. And then you did that on purpose. Gotta say, honey, I'm awfully fatter that you're trying to follow me and all, but I call that stock and keep it up, and you're gonna rest. You're just gonna. <laughs> She's accusing him of stalking. <laughs> I'm all for passionate romance, but you gotta hold back a bit, you know? Uh, <laughs> it isn't funny. like that. It is true you helped me out today. I do appreciate it. Such a good boy. No more of the stalking, though. All right. Boy. How many times do I have to tell you I'm not? <laughs> I might have said more than I should, but I just know how you're feeling. You must be real frustrated, right? Mm -hmm. Well, me too, honey. 13 long years, my heart's been pounding. No way am I losing my chance now. Hey, wait. <laughs> oh, dude. Where did I stop? Where did I stop? Right there. Oh, dude, she's still going. I'm so... <sighs> okay, I thought I missed half the footage, but I'm so glad we recovered it. She literally just pounced on top of him. I happened to click the space bar at the right time. I felt a touch and I looked and I'm like, okay, I stopped recording. But look at this. I'm going to make you embrace our <laughs> feeling. Oh my god. <laughs> what? <laughs> Holy shit. This is an incredible game. It's simply incredible on every aspect. In front of Naima, you also get, get me an info. Sorry, I forget it. Drew, you also can now remember to investigate, right? You know, you're such a softie. Of course, you were my first pick for this gig. But I think I've been too reliant on your strengths. I'll be more considerate of your weakness going forward. But don't let it get you down, okay? I'll try not to overestimate you, <laughs> and you can't give me lame excuses. Regarding your appetite. Yeah. <laughs> no, it's uh. really. You know what? Never mind. Understood. And we'll call this one a wrap. Thanks anyway, Joryu. Phew. I don't think I've ever been so exhausted. <laughs> I'll try to put it out of my mind. <laughs> Dude, I gotta play the previous games. 
they were always people recommended these games to me and they're like Nestor you would like these games and it's been since I was like oh, man at least three more extra years than like when I started playing like a dragon they said Evangelion and Yakuza I would like and I'm, I'm just barely getting to this man and like they were right I haven't watched Evangelion yet but we're still working through that okay 13 years that was the last game came out that's a lot of time for games understood my circumstances what am I saying that's impossible level 9 I had fun I had a lot of fun with that I had so much fun. I'm gonna do two things. I'm gonna sell my silver plate in order to get the extra 10,000. Maybe some extra shit, I don't know. Let's find a, let's find a pawn shop. I hope this is one. I'm sorry if I'm exploring the game too much for you guys. Like, it's um... I'm here to sell, let's see. But I am having fun with this, I, I will say. Oh, dude, we're almost there. The dragon, the, dude, I'll literally have the dragon's eye. I'm also buzzing, it's like 12 o'clock. And uh, I've been recording these videos in succession. And I'm just like, anytime a good thing happens that I do in the game, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna pound a beer. Been like once an episode, so I'm, I'm 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 having fun. Fun fact about me: I like Coors Banquet. Oh shit! Can I run away realistically? I have to finish the battle. Damn. I got nothing. Like it? Dude, can you imagine just seeing a dude with a sledgehammer? I didn't even notice the ladies in the background. I mean, that's cool. At least it's like they're actually moving. I thought it was going to be a still for a second like this. Even the small details. Can you imagine the guy who's like crafting this as far as the game? Like, you know what? Let's get some shades right there. Really put it together. There's so many assets in the game. Although, how many times has this wall been copied and pasted? Who knows? They had to make a custom here, definitely. Junior! I've been waiting on you. Bounty, level 8 to level 9. Dude, we need 100,000 more. If we do the last request, we should be good. Looks like a new job came in. Yosoki Morishita. Let's start the job. What is this? Anna? The Red Peacocks are a gang that starts throwing their weight around Sotenbori lately. There are three main gangs in Sotenbori, this area included. But these days, the disputes between them have gotten worse. They're a real headache for the general public. Mm. Among them, the Red Peacocks are a peculiar, particularly violent bunch attacking passerby who happens to piss them off, destroying property. Real low lives in every sense of the word. Damn. She's getting a lot of work. They do sound like a problem. Uh. I hope to take care of it myself, but it's not exactly easy. There are being so many. Done I handle this would be a cakewalk for you, right? It'd be a reward. It's quite handsomely. I'm not thrilled about this, but we can't just look to slide, especially if they're hurting innocent people. Where are so they? Yeah, a parking lot 
at West Shofoku. Should be a bunch of guys in red tracksuits. Thanks a bunch, Joryu. Uh, got it. I like the picture Kazuma is like Sly. Sylvester still on, you know what I'm saying? Let's go ahead and keep running. Look at that. Let's pop the map. Looks like our destination is right here. Dipping and dashing. One on one, let's see. this Good. hey you guys the red peacocks <sighs> huh what do you want old man there have been complaints about your conduct around here I'm here to suggest that you act more courteous <laughs> <laughs> you came here just to warn us you're even dumber than you look old man you got a dash waste or something we're both bothering people why don't you try and stop us all right, red peacocks. I like it. They just get red hoodies. Oh, the boss is extra thick. I like the damage resistance. I need some heat, actually. Let's see. Nice. I like how they call him old man. I'm just thinking about that realistically. Because, like, this is like... He has an ultimate? I wasn't expecting that. I'm glad it wasn't too brutal, but I'm like... I'm trying to think about the time span from when, like, the you first... Because the game in the franchise came out versus, like, right now. I mean, this guy is not weak either. I'm just trading blows with him, mostly. Although that kind of thickened it up. Damn. Dude, a knee to the face? That does major damage. That should have been a finishing move, but instead I got this kick. Or this, this slight jab. <laughs> that should have been... Dude, I, I kind of beat myself up because if I don't finish fights in ultimates, it doesn't look as cool. Who the yeah. hell are you? I don't have a name. And even if we did, it makes you think you deserve to hear it. This isn't over. We'll make sure you regret messing with the red peacocks. We're out there. I mean, yeah, this is some gang shit. Look at the guy on the right with the bandana. Like, that's there's no coming back from that. Looks like there's more red peacocks out there. I should look around for them. All right, I'm look. I'm looking for my red peacock. Let's look at another's right here. Take the bridge or what? Good. Hey, you guys, red peacocks, too. Eh? You, you're that son of a bitch without a name. Yeah, we know what you did to our buddies. We're gonna fucking kill you. Damn. It's coming. Alright, let's do it. Right here, double Alright. Alright. I can knock one in. Oh shit. I'm gonna do inventory real quick, tap the Z. Alright, so we're we're working on Tasha Power. Oh, let me see. I can parry him. Start off with some heat. Add some, a little bit of spice to the battle. Ooh. I managed to get a heat combo. I don't know what that combo is. Fuck that one up. He's 
comes out. Damn, I missed that. I like how this game is like a street brawl, basically. So many people love it for that reason. Like, literally, it's just like, let's go beat the fuck out of whoever over here. Alright, hold up, hold up. He's got the stun damage on him. And he didn't know what was coming. Game set and match. Face down on the floor, dude? Come on. Where is the A game around here? Who the fuck is this guy? Shit, he's tough. Seems like they're still red. Peacock's causing troubles. I'll see where I can find them. Alright, let's go and continue our journey searching for red peacocks. It's like probably the last one would probably be over here. Let's go ahead and run up. Flicky. Oh, I remember that game. I wonder if it's a ROM they got. Sega produced it. I remember it was on uh, Sonic Mega Collection, which is the same producers who produced this, as you guys know. But, um, hey, what was Flicky specifically? I know it was the birds that he saved. I'll have to Google that. Good. Hey, you guys, Red Peacocks, uh -huh. too? Yeah, you're the dumbass without a name. <laughs> you're the dumbass without a name. <laughs> yeah, we know what you did to our buddies. Oh, that's that's some repeated dialogue. <clears throat> Run it through Chad GB2. That would be my recommendation. Alright, two times. Two times. Oh. Hit, 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 hit. Alright, hold on. Alright, so we got him. Let's use heat specifically. Nice. Yamaguchi has no idea what's going on. Yamaguchi is just zoned in for the ass beating. Oh damn, only one punch. Nice. I did with the ultimate counter. I felt that zoned in. Yamaguchi had no idea what was happening to him, dog. You know what I'm saying? Holy shit, this guy's the real deal. Seems like there are still red peacocks causing trouble, I see. Man, there's... <coughs> How many are there? Last one. Okay, let's finish up the red peacocks. Because they're becoming a real pecan in my ass. It's supposed to be a pun, but I didn't have anywhere to go with it. One million, that's so insane. Um, you'll have before the next battle. I'll go ahead and take a hard right. Alright, hold on. All just for a single item that's gonna probably make the rest of the game super easy. Right there. Good. Hey, you guys, Red Peacocks, too. Eh? You. Okay. Yeah, that's that's the same. That's what I mean, dude. I'm like, the original piece of dialogue wasn't good to begin with. Then <laughs> you have a copy to paste. I don't know. People do. I don't know. It's not that big of a deal. It's not like it's a game defect. But I could tell that was like a decision on their part to go ahead and do that. Nice. Oh, there's a briefcase right there. Nice. 
Man, I am comboing as well. Damn, right on the wall. Surprised he's not doing that. Ultimate, which he parried into. Alright, not bad. Uh, your two tough seems like they're still okay. Yeah, we're good on that. Is it recording? Oh. About to end it. Oh, Joe, you about the. Uh, the leader, Gurn, is apparently looking for you. He's been storming around. To, who's the piece of shit coward who's been beating up my guys? Where it is in the parking lot? We go uh. check the exam. Ah, uh, we don't have to end it here. Let's 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 finish up the red peacocks. I get the last of it. Because realistically, I just want to get the eye and equip that. Damn, boring. I can't even run from it if I want to. Alright, does it lost me? Hold XD. Nice. That felt good. Alright, let's go ahead and see. I might have to swap to a brawler style. <clears throat> Show yourself, you piece Boy. of shit coward, looking for me. Huh? Well, d well, you decided to come to me. How kind of you travel all this way? You've been treating my guys so nice. I figured I'd repay the kindness. Yeah. Your words are more than enough. I beg to differ. I can't have you fucking around with the red peacock. Uh -huh. I am the only one, only Guru and President of the Red Peacock. I'm gonna put you in the ground right here, right now. The serpent? Alright, let's go ahead and hit him with a one-two combo here. Oh shit. <laughs> Dude, the laugh killed me too. Not bad. Alright. Aw, oh, dude, come on. and beam. Here, let's see. Damn, dude, come on. I didn't know you could get in tug of wars with it. This is actually a little bit harder than I was expecting. I thought it was gonna be like the other battles, but like, I'm glad they gave him some purple. Man, this is the serpent. <laughs> I just realized it. I saw the hold A button action item in the, in the background. Alright, let's see. Kick the shit out of him. Alright. Let's go ahead and swap. Damn. Mega Walkathon. 
Alright, let's turn on my heat. Gotta dodge around him enough. I don't wanna use all my health items on a set boss like this. Oh come on dude, he keeps he he keeps kicking me. I gotta make sure I'm aware of that. Oh a one two combo, you dodge, dude. Oh dodge. Nice. Alright. Took the first damage, but not the second. I'll take it. Man, dude, I'm leaving help. I don't wanna I don't wanna risk playing chicken with this. Man, come on. Come on. Nice. Kick the shit out of everybody. <coughs> Whoa, who the fuck are you? I hope this teaches you a lesson. Give up your ways. Uh, you what's up? Akame, I took the leader of the Red Peacocks. Guess this takes care of that. No kidding. Everyone's gonna be so happy. Thanks a bunch. Vanquish the Red Peacocks. Well, we'll go ahead and call it a day there. If you enjoyed this content, make sure to like, comment, subscribe down below. But we're gonna go ahead and get our Red Dragon eye next episode, so I'm pretty excited about that. Anyway, guys, have a good one. See ya. Oh, didn't stop.